Hello and welcome. It's time to announce the winners for Kendra's card challenge number nine. This is a quarterly card making challenge that started on January 1st and ended on March 31st of 2023. If you're not familiar with the challenge, I provide a free printable on my website that contains cutting guides and card sketches where you can make a bunch of cards with just six sheets of six by six pattern paper plus other card stock and supplies. But it's a great way to use up those pattern papers that you have in your stash. Now, if you're watching during the premiere, I hope you'll join me in the live chat for a chance to win some digital files. Please feel free to ask any questions you may have for me. Now, I will first showcase all of the January entries that were submitted to the Kendra's Card Challenges Facebook group. I'll be going through these fairly quickly, but remember you can always take a look at all of the entries in the group under the photo albums. Now, if you're not watching this video during the premiere and you're here to see if you're a winner, Please feel free to skip ahead if you don't want to see all of the wonderful card making inspiration that I'm about to share. For challenge nine, we had over 400 entries, which is more than double than what we had for challenge number eight. Plus there were a lot of videos posted on YouTube featuring the cards made with challenge nine. So if you want to check out these videos, you can do a search on YouTube using the hashtag Kendra's card challenge nine or KCC nine to find those. Now, if you're new to my channel and you didn't get to participate in challenge number nine or any of the other previous challenges, you can still get access to the printables over on my Patreon page when you join as a patron. If you become a supporter of my challenges, you'll have access to all of my previous card challenge printables, numbers one through nine for only $5. In addition, you'll get a handmade card from me each month, plus access to a printer friendly version of the current challenge printable. As an all access patron for $10 a month, you'll get access to monthly bonus printables and early access to my card challenges. And as a VIP patron for $25 a month, you'll get a card making kit and a crafty zoom session with me each quarter. I hope you'll consider joining as a patron to help support my work. The, the giveaway prize that I'm giving away for three lucky commenters in the live chat during the premiere is the April of 2023 bonus printable, which includes three sheets of digital images and sentiments that match the shapes on the card sketches for challenge number 10. There's a sheet for birthdays, a sheet for thank yous, and a sheet for all occasions. Other bonus printables that you'll get instant access to if you join as an all access or VIP patron include digital papers, digital stamps, digital card making kits, one sheet wonder files, fun fold tutorials, and more. It's definitely worth it to join as a member. Plus you can cancel it at any time. I will place a link to my Patreon page down in the description box below. I want to invite you to join us on challenge number 10, which was posted on April 1st. This quarterly contest ends on June 30th of 2023. Just like with challenge nine, you can make 15 cards with six sheets of six by six paper. Now these are standard A2 American size cards, but there are a few changes on how to enter this quarter that I want to mention. There will be three different official entry photo albums for challenge number 10, one for each month, and you will post your photo of all 15 cards into the album for the month that you're uploading it should be one photo of all 15 cards. Now, due to some of the prizes needing to be shipped, I will need you to put your name and country of residence in your photo caption when you upload your photos to those albums. I will have to filter, filter out the entries for the US participants for certain prizes. Now, after I showcase all of the entries, the winners for challenge nine will be shown. And if you're a winner, you will need to claim your prize within seven days. So I'm going to go ahead and put on some music while I showcase the rest of the entries and I'll join you back here in just a bit.
Thank you so much for watching the showcase. I know that was a lot of cards, but I have truly enjoyed seeing how everyone has taken these sketches and made them their own. I hope you are inspired to get creative. So here are the winners for sketches 11 through 15. Now let's pick the prize winners for the March monthly prizes. Now I'm using wheelofnames.com to randomly select the winners. I have all of the names of those who entered the challenge by posting a photo into the KCC9 official entry photo album in the Facebook group or that have uploaded it to the entry form on my website here on this spreadsheet. And I'm just gonna copy them over into the box. So let's spin and see who the prize winners are. I'll place the prize that is won in the bottom left-hand corner. And our first winner of a stamp set from Artful Angel is... Paula McLean. Congratulations, Paula. Now let's see who the winners are for the stamp sets from Colorado Craft Company. The first stamp set winner is Mary Ann Hires. Congratulations. The second stamp set winner from Colorado Craft Company is Susan Landers. Congratulations, Susan. The third stamp set winner from Colorado Craft Company is Sammy Jean. Congratulations, Sammy. The fourth stamp set winner is Jennifer Rosa Markle Clee. Congratulations, Jennifer. And the fifth stamp set winner is Christina Mathy. Congratulations, Christina. The next March prize winner for a stamp from Prickly Pear Stamps is. Wendy Wagerman Smith. Congratulations, Wendy. The next March prize winner who will receive a confetti mix from This Calls for Confetti is Katie Arvidson. Congratulations, Katie. Now let's see who the winner is for a digital download of your choice from TLC Designs. And the winner is Natalie Godfrey. Congratulations, Natalie. Now let's pick the winners for the quarterly prizes. So here I'm going to copy all of the entries, all 429 of them from this spreadsheet. And I'm gonna do the same as before. I'm gonna copy them over into willofnames.com. This is going to take me a minute because there's so many, but isn't that awesome? All of this card making inspiration. Now let me shuffle these up and uh, I know this wheel looks crazy. You can't even read the names, but I promise you they are all there. <laughs> so let's see who the winner is for the Catherine Pooler Designs $25 gift certificate. And the winner is Robin Peak. Congratulations, Robin. Now let's see who the winner is for the Gina K Designs $25 gift certificate. And the winner is Cindy Vernon. Congratulations, Cindy. Now for the winner of the $25 gift certificate to Cat Scrappiness. And the winner is Renee Stewart Price. Congratulations, Renee. Now the winner for the $25 gift certificate to Lawn Fawn. And the winner is Jeanette Carton. Congratulations, Jeanette. 
now the winner of the My Favorite Things $25 gift certificate. And the winner is... Deborah Westerman. Congratulations, Deborah. And now for the winner of the Not Too Shabby Shop $25 gift certificate. And the winner is Beatrice Torres. Congratulations, Beatrice. And now for the winner of the $25 gift certificate to Pear Blossom Press. And the winner is Amalia Montano. Congratulations, Amalia. And now for the $25 prize pack from Pink and Main. And the winner is Brandy Elliott. Congratulations, Brandy. And now there are two $20 gift cards from Prickly Pear Stamps that we'll be spending for. And the first winner is... Elizabeth Johnston. Congratulations, Elizabeth. And the second winner is... Beverly Lancaster. Congratulations, Beverly. And now for the winner of the Scrappy Tales Crafts $25 gift certificate. And the winner is Alessandra Lamone. Congratulations, 5K. That's what we call you over on Craft Roulette, which if you're not familiar with Craft Roulette, you definitely want to check that out. Um, and now the winner for the Sweet November Stamps $50 gift certificate. And the winner is Lynn Sanders. Congratulations, Lynn. And now for the $25 gift certificate to This Calls for Confetti. And the winner is Terry McNeil. Congratulations, Terry. And now for the winner of the $30 gift certificate to TLC Designs. And the winner is Judy Ellisper. Congratulations, Judy. Or Ellisper, sorry if I mispronounced it. And now for the $50 gift voucher to Whimsy Stamps. The winner is Sarah Bishop Luke. Congratulations, Sarah. And for the $50 gift certificate to your next stamp. And the winner is... Lynn Mann. Congratulations, Lynn. And our final prize for the night is... A Spellbinders card making kit that's donated by one of our design team members, Sire Anderson. And the winner is Jennifer Ritchie Cox. Congratulations, Jennifer. So congratulations to all of the winners. If you're a winner, please complete the form linked in the description box below and do this by April 10th to claim your prize. I want to thank everyone who participated in the challenge. I've really enjoyed seeing everyone's cards. If you do the math, there were 6,435 cards made using Challenge 9, which is amazing. I'd also like to take a moment to thank all of the prize sponsors for Challenge Number 9. I'm so grateful for your generosity and support of my card challenges. I hope you all can join us again for the new quarterly card challenge number 10 that runs from April 1st through June 30th of 2023. The new PDF is available for download at kendrascardchallenges.com. Many of our wonderful sponsors have agreed to sponsor the prizes for this quarterly challenge as well. Plus, there are four new company prize sponsors this quarter. Our new prize sponsors are Altenew, Craft & Kimmy Stamps, Polka Doodles, and Uniquely Creative. 
you can have a chance to win one of many prizes totaling more than $1,000. If you missed the video where I introduced Challenge 10, I will link it in the description box. Also, if you missed the KCC 10 giveaway video hop here on YouTube where each of the 15 design team members shared a sketch from Challenge 10, I will also link that video where to, of where to start. This hop goes through April 9th and you can have a chance to win a huge bag of crafty goodies if you watch all of the videos in the hop and fill out the form in the description box. Now all of their cards are wonderful and you won't be disappointed, I promise. Now I'd like to take a moment to thank all of my current channel patrons. I really appreciate your generosity and support. If you're not already a patron, I really hope you will consider becoming one. I want to thank you for watching all the way to the end of this video. I would love it if you'd share the challenge with your crafty friends to help me spread the word. I hope you can join us on the next challenge and I can't wait to see what you all create. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a wonderful day.